Hi everyone, welcome back to Spring Web Flux Essentials. And let's continue the test, but now we are going to do it for the controller. So just uh, press Alt Enter or Option Enter here and then create test, Anime Controller Test. OK. And uh, we can go into our Anime Service and we can copy what we are going to use. Since this is just unit tests, we can basically do the same thing as we did here. So you can copy all the way to block count. Okay, so let's start to change some stuff. Now that we are testing the controller, the inject max should be anime controller. And here, anime controller. The mock now is not the repository, but the anime service. And then we just add the name anime service mock. And here, private final, we are going to keep the same block hound. And uh, we are going to leave the this for now because we probably are going to uh, reuse some stuff. So let's just rename here anime service mock, find all, then return uh, flux anime. So the first method that we are going to test is the actually list all. So block count works, and then we can start by uh, creating the, the first one. So we can actually copy the, the one that we have here. But we will just change a couple of stuff. So find all, return a flex of anime. So it's the same thing, anime, uh, sorry, but here is not anime service, it's anime controller. So it's type verifier, create anime controller, list all, expect subscription, Anime verify complete. So let's see if these two tests are working. Just run here. Cool. So both of them are working. Now let's uh, go back to anime service and we can go straight to find by ID and we can copy both of them. Okay, so find by ID, and if we go to our controller, we have find by ID, the same stuff. And here is not anime service, it's anime controller find by ID. So we can come back here, and now we change anime repository to anime service. So anime service mock dot find by ID. When I send uh, any request from my controller to this, it will return a mono of anime. I will leave the same and now find by the returns mono error. So the same thing. Anime service mock find by ID. And we are going to return mono empty. But uh, in this case it will not work like this. Why? Because the service is the one that's responsible for doing uh, that uh, business logic. So what we can do here is just change the return. We can change the return to mono.error. And then uh, we return here new runtime exception. So here we only want to check if the mono error is being returned. Not like we are doing any checks at the anime controller anyway. So actually, we are not going to test this. Why? Because for us, the controller is what we need to, to test. The service is the one responsible for returning that exception. Since we are not doing anything with that exception, we are okay. So when we go to the integration tests, we can test that error that's being returned. So, so far, I think this find by ID is okay. Let's just run this one. Final by ID is also working. What we can do now is uh, run this with coverage. So I'm running the anime service with coverage. As you can see, 100 meth, 100% of the, those methods and 100% of the line is covered. And uh, when we finish the anime controller test, we do the same. 
Okay, so let's stop for now. In the next video, we will continue with uh, more tests in the animal controller test. So, see you there. Bye.